And welcome back to another episode of Anthem. We last left off. While we were doing some campaign, there now seems to be some updates to the game as well. It uh, informed me that there's a new melee slot in the armory. And this is in the daily trial. Hey, buddy. Try to look. Echoes of reality. Alright, well, we are going to walk around and see as much as we can. Also, I think I'm going to put my headset on so it's a bit more immersive. And so you guys don't hear it through my mic a second time. Just turn down the monitor. Alright, let's take a walk around. symbol but either way yep Alex dude is gone he left the fort you need to get moving no telling what trouble he's stirring up Prison. All right. Well, I guess we'll finish the story first before we do whatever that is. Interesting. Requires things we don't have, so. Hey, we just restocked our shelves. Guess we will have to get into the events and see what's happening. So. Don't remember what we did last in the forge, so let's have what a look. Plus, it has a new melee right. spot, Where do you apparently. Want to start? The assaults are currently equipped with a siege cannon. No, we're not. We're equipped with the railgun. My bad. Better flat cannon. Damage is significantly lower. Uh, 
I don't entirely remember my buttons either, so I am going to have to try a, a little longer. Oh, there we go. Melee weapon. Okay. That one's still going to be the best. Now it says a rare auto cannon. Now the auto cannon was pretty decent. That was a pretty decent one. I think we're going to stick with the auto cannon. Not sure why this isn't. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, seismic glove, huh? Okay. So that slots you 62 to 350. Things that one. It's also a shield refresh, but we're going to go with this. Okay, support gear. I have this equipped. It's actually something I didn't like using. Keep it for now, just to see. Alright. Start an expedition. Let's see where we end up. Contracts first. Should probably do this to get back into the game since it's been a while. And Ranger helmet. Well, hello. Apparently, my audio is not going to my headset. Can Ranger. And clearly, no, I'm not a ranger. Good game. Uh, let's see, Logitech, there we go. Alright, I should be able to hear you on my headset instead of my speakers now. As long as it's switched over properly. Alright, start the expedition. Ah, uh, I can set the public. Uh, I might as well do private so it's faster. May I join you? Um. Well, I mean, you could join me. Um, I 
I'm on Xbox. I guess you'll have to send me your camera tag in uh, chat. Sentinels have gone missing. I need you to head to their last known location. I'll check it out. Alright, how we fly. Hey, how's it going? It's going good, how about you? Uh, not too bad. Just, uh... I see you trying to get back into the swing of things. Yeah, I haven't, uh, <laughs> I haven't played in a while. About a month or so. I just recently started playing again, got myself back up to um, 300, almost 400. Oh, nice. Looks like the Sentinels are captured by scars. Set the patrol free. Yeah, I uh, haven't finished the story yet, so. Yeah, I, I'm almost done. I just gotta do one little last mission. I can't do that until I need enough powers. Yeah, I haven't even got Just helping out others. I haven't even got the but I got the last mission though. Let's see, I'm on, uh, I'm on that one where Halleck ran off, but I, I like to try to do the contracts and all that stuff before I do the missions. I didn't think any backup was coming. You're not that far behind me if you're on the part where Holly ran off. That's always good. 
Thanks, Freelancer. I don't think I'm going to survive without you. Side missions? A beam? I know I did some of them, but I'm not sure if I did a lot of them. Oh, okay. Any idea what the new stuff is that they got going? Uh, strongholds and new cataclysms. Help the Sentinels take out the Scorpion eggs. Scorpion eggs. Say what you said again. Ah, uh, Scorpion eggs. Have we got any back to work? Have I what? Got any masterwork items? Like uh, masterwork, uh, uh, masterwork on weapons or anything? No, just the uh, the one that you get for the DLC or whatever. That uh, League of Dawn or whatever. Oh, uh, well, I got a masterwork uh, weapon. Probably puts your uh, numbers up pretty high.
So do you like to usually just like do a few missions and then do your gear, or do you like to do your gear after every mission? Do my gear after every mission. Alright. Cause I like to stay on time, just in case. Cause you never know. Oh, some fancy shiny gear you got going. It's diamond scales. I mean not diamond scales, but it's dragon scales. Nice. What are we up to today? All right, just let me know when you're ready.
So let me guess, you like all black? Yeah, I usually make my armor yeah. as dark as possible with some... Sometimes with some stuff on it, sometimes just all black. Can't get mad at that, you know? That's usually a good solid choice for most games. That's my choice for any game, honestly, because I, because black is my favorite. How do I, uh, how do I actually ready up myself? Looks like it's individual readying up. Oh, it's just, oh, okay, never mind. It's just getting into here. Okay. I don't usually play with a squad on here. My one buddy that's been uh, wanting, or I've been wanting him to play. Every time we go to play, he's got update to do. <laughs> it takes days. <laughs> All right, let's go get Halleck, or whatever happens with this anyway. words I ever speak to him. I can't raise him. He's not responding. I'll get him back. Any sign of Halleck? Pretty quiet. Nothing so far. I'll look around. Not loving the idea of being back here. <laughs> what could go wrong?
They just fucked me up. That hurt. <laughs> yeah, they pack a punch. even in here. Halleck! <laughs> Over here. You almost got yourself killed. Why didn't you call me? Although, this looks pretty impressive. It was Owen. Owen? Yeah. That two-faced bastard came out of nowhere. He's a crap pilot, but... Javelin is something else. Oh, I got a few, but not enough. <sighs> you know, freelancer is all I ever wanted to be. It's all I do. I got no family. Poured every bit of me into being the best. Chasing my dream of the Legion of Dawn. Read their stories so much I can recite them from memory. Yeah. Me too. Know why? You taught me. Taught most of us. I don't want to be a teacher. Hey, come on. This isn't about you. Being a freelancer is about the team. You showed me that. <sighs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, look who's back. Here's that two-faced bastard now. Owen! You got a lot of nerve. It's strange seeing me pilot this javelin. You never recognized my unique talents. Oh, and the monitor did? Yes, he did, actually. I heard that didn't really work out. No, but for a while, it was brilliant. The Dawn Shield came up. I was magnificent. You should have seen me. Then, of course, it didn't halt. Seems it needs her signet, but I suspect that you know that already. So naturally, disaster, retreat, failure, in any case, my punishment. The Dominion and I have since parted ways. Well, I think you learned your lesson. Oh, and I think you are very lucky I was there to save your ass. It seems your legendary capabilities were oversold. Just a touch. Hold on a second. You built your own dawn shield. Faye must have pulled the blueprints from the fortress. That's very clever. So you are still heading to the cenotaph, but why haven't... It doesn't work. Does it? No, it doesn't work. Not even with her signet. Oh dear, how very upsetting. Okay, playtime's over. Give us the general. No, 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 no. This belongs to me now. Oh, and I swear Halleck. to God. This doesn't concern you. We need to talk. Go get the Strider. I'll see you back in Tarsus. Face bastard. <laughs> we were partners. Even friends. If you hadn't just saved Halleck's life, I'd... I've heard it. The anthem, I've heard it too. I understand how it can drive a person to do terrible things. Okay. I watched the monitor hear it again. 
He's become crazed. He's got this machine, this weapon. And he's going to get it to the Cenotaph any way he can, even if that means dragging it across a bridge of his own dead soldiers. Okay, thanks for the heads up. I'm sorry. I know I don't deserve your forgiveness. But I'm hoping I can make amends. Maybe even save your life. Here. Take this, my friend. I mean, I'm sure you probably would have worked it out eventually, but there's no time, is there? I mean, just get Faye to reverse engineer it, fix your shield, pull the whole load, blah, blah, blah. Where are you gonna go? Uh, I'm not really sure, to be honest. Um, east, west, you know. Again, I am sorry. Right, you've said. Yeah, uh, not just for that. Uh, I'm sensing a whole load of Dominion Furies heading this way right now. Ooh, <laughs> they seem particularly nasty. You should be fine, though. Good luck, hero! Oh, you son of a bitch! <laughs> well, at least we're in for a good fight. Hey, okay, what is this? Sorry, Owen wasn't kidding. A Fury you can see that. Top of the line Dominion. But you're a top of the line freelancer, right? Gotta find out. There we go. Shields down. Where the hell? Guess we really pissed someone off, huh? You should be flattered. Right, every bullet's a compliment. Fuck your shield. Yeah, bitch. Of course he wasn't going to get very far. He didn't have a weapon. <laughs> he didn't have a weapon that he... Half the time he can't even move his javelin. <laughs> his javelin got busted up. He's been trying to fix it ever since. Yeah, he had to work through his mental block to be able to operate it. <laughs> yeah, but that mental block is the reason why he hasn't been able to do a damn thing. Flight suppression everywhere. I can match oh, short hops. Flight but suppression. But he does have a shield out. Hell no. It's all or nothing, Alec. Oh, God, You're dead wrong. You worry about those suppression machines on carbon path. Oh, okay. oh, Alright. Let's get rid of these fucking cross things. Bay, we're not gonna last long out here. You need an extraction. I'm hoping you can work a miracle. Come on in. Hang tight. your fingernails. Alright, what else we got? Oh, got one of those fucks. I can one shot him. Ouch. Nice. Oh, that was a big guy. Let's get him.
red dot. You did it. I'm sure they're just getting started. Hey, how's that miracle coming? You just worry about the fight. I'll find a way to get you out of there. Alec, how's it coming? Just focus on the fight. I'll get this suppression thing sorted. You know, I kind of have to worry about both. No, you don't. That's what I was going to tell you. Trust your team. Do your part, we'll do ours. Everyone wins. When I was trapped in that canyon, I covered the north side. My buddy covered the south. And you know what? I never looked south. The Dominion really needed this time. Use your geography. Find the cover. An ambush works both ways. Don't ever retreat. If you do, you're dead. It's gonna be forward momentum. Put the right, on their heels. It'd be easier if I could fly. Yeah, yeah, I'm working on it. Want to save me? Get your fired up. 
So the whole dead weight thing? Lancers never give up. A good leader knows what motivates their people. My buddy in the canyon, he'd ask me how things looked my way to the north. I kept telling him it's all good. I was lying my ass off getting hammered by outlaws, but it kept my buddy going. So, how's it going, kid? It's all good. Hang in there, Roland. Only fail with what maybe once or twice? Uh, I think just once that time. Only once last time, too, I think. Got two achievements that time. That's how you know I still need to think be stronger. Yeah, I, I have the advantage of using the heavy guy, so he, he doesn't go down as much. Yeah. Some running around to do, talking to people. So you're saying you're only like a couple of missions ahead of where I am right now?
What are we up to today? How do you, uh, how do you use the melee that they added? Okay, so it's just me smashing it around. Look who it is. You certainly know how to put a javelin through its paces. Never just go for a stroll out there, do you? You expect any less? I shouldn't. You've got your sights set on the heart of rage. Not the first time for you either. All part of the adventure, right? I'm always moving forward, but now it's time to go back. Sometimes that's the way. I took my son to the platform earlier. We watched the freelancers take off. He said he's going to fly out there and do something awesome. It's not the worst dream to have. Are you less worried about him becoming a freelancer? Oh, I'll always worry. I worry about all of you. You can't get rid of me that easily. I run routine maintenance checks. I probably could. What? <laughs> I've put enough work into those javelins of yours. You better bring them back. Is that why you do it? Not everyone comes back. Happens every day. The little touches. I will settle like a threat. They, the suits, <laughs> but they mean someone cares. You're not just another number. You said the fort's your home. Just my way of keeping the lights on for you. Hey, Mom. Hello. I went looking for your father's ashes so we could spread them. They weren't there. Doesn't mean we still can't have a memorial for him. It's the strangest thing. The vase was gone. Someone must have stolen it. I'm sure it'll turn up. I hope so. As your father. It's all I have left of him. And yet... Something wrong? Remembering your dad. Something about all this doesn't feel right. So what are you talking about now? Uh, this this one here, I'm on this talking to some old lady who's like, her daughter died in the heart of rage or something. She thinks I'm her. This may sound weird, but I need you to trust me. This could be a good sign. 
that I have a knack for losing stuff. Then you're realizing, well, what you thought was true isn't. The vase? Why is it so important? Your dad, of course. He died. But I already knew that. How did he die? A broken heart. Losing you. And what does that mean? What do you think? You were our daughter. That day when you... No, please. This is important. How did you lose me? There's a memory. You were hurt. I know it hurts, but I think you're in denial. Remembering what really happened could help. I don't know if I can do this. You can. You're strong. Apparently I'm helping what you happened? remember now. It was a warm day. Fremont was hot that time of year. You were playing with your father, pretending you were a javelin pilot. He was roaring like an ursix, chasing you. You were so young. Your little legs scampering around, so happy. But then... It's okay. The sirens started. Gunfire was everywhere. Someone shouted, the Dominion are here. Then the explosions... I heard you scream. Ran over. Your father was bleeding, but you... You were under the rubble. Piles of concrete. I tried lifting it, but it was too heavy. You were yelling. Daddy's hurt. Help Daddy. I pulled him away. Then there was another explosion. The rubble collapsed. But you... You... You can do this. You died. My brave little girl. You were supposed to grow up and be a freelancer, fall in love, become a woman. But you never did. Because I couldn't save you. Can you ever forgive me? It's better if you forgive yourself. How can I? Your father. He died the next day. They took him away. I never got to bury him. Or you. None of it was your fault. I loved both of you so much. Are you watching our mixture? For this. But how can this be? Uh huh. Okay. How are you here, all grown up? Can, can the anthem really do that? Sarana, what's happening? Uh, <clears throat> I'm actually your friend. I'm not Sarana. You thought I was, but I'm just a friend trying to help. A friend? But you said you followed your dream. There was no better job in the world. That Dad would want us to spread his ashes together? None of that was true. Mm. Well... <laughs> they don't always give you good options of this, either. No, I'm sorry. You only thought it was. It's just... everything you said. I really thought you were Serana. I didn't mean to lead you on. No, I understand. It's just... when hope suddenly evaporates, there's a... hole. It will take some time to figure all this out. Of course. Be well. Well? Hopefully that one plays out well. Great. A few new ones have opened. Martin was looking for me. Alright. Let's see who else is down here. Halleck. Hey. Something wrong? No. This is just me being contemplative, as Faye says. About what? Giving you a Halleck pearl of wisdom that'll matter. And I think it's this. Don't ever believe you're immortal. Want to make your mark? Become a legend? Then assume the next fight is your last. Oh. Uh, so you like this instance right now? It won't be, or that's not inspiring. They're both about almost the same fucking thing. But it's not. I don't fight to lose. No freelancer does. I didn't. But waiting around for your moment, thinking it's going to happen tomorrow, just means it won't happen today. You haven't been waiting around, Halleck. Of course I have. The heart of rage messed me up. I didn't want to admit I was the weak link. I was getting old. 
figured I had all the time in the world. <laughs> but none of us do. You write your own legend today. Not mine. Ours. And that's the other piece of advice. Never go it alone. Some young freelancer with an attitude told me that. Funny, I thought it was some old cranky freelancer. Sounds like they could be friends. We beat this, and there'll be plenty of time to find out. You know where to find me. All right. Let's see who's left. Somebody up there. It's probably the scientist chick. Oh, it might be the Matthias group. Nadira, freelancer. My husband Leighton mentioned you saw him again. We spoke. He told me about his past. What he did for the Dominion. Pretty bad, I'm guessing. Mm. It was. But he regrets all the pain he caused. He still feels it. I don't know how to make it go away. He talked about someone named Aurora. I think it's a woman he knew. Something bad happened to her. Aurora? That rings a bell? I've seen the name. A briefing on an old Dominion operation. Details were sketchy. I'm trying to remember. I think it was called Prism Tusset. That was their code name for it. Do you think Leighton was involved? He must have been. But if I ask him, it'll get messy. I'm his wife now, not his debriefing agent. There's too much emotion involved. Mm. Let's go with Strong. That just means you care. Leighton's lucky he found you. <laughs> Who knew spying was the easy part? His marriage that takes training. <laughs> <laughs> Can't help you there. You've already done more than you had to. I appreciate it. We both do. When I see Leighton again, I'll ask him about this prism tacit. Thank you. Alright. Well, looks like we still gotta to talk to Matthias. Oh, we're down to one. I've discovered something in the Elysian manuscript. Repeating symbols spread throughout the text. A pattern that, once decoded, shows a set of coordinates. Coordinates for what? Unknown. Robin Moore. Its primary author must have buried them in the manuscript. Moore was one of the greatest arcanists in history. His understanding of shaper instruments was unparalleled. I don't like making assumptions, but what's at these coordinates must be... Apparently I have to do the same to mission the we just did. Precisely. Apparently. Oh really? Leave it to me. <clears throat> oh really? Yep. Well that's good. But uh... But, uh I wonder why we have to do it again if why? we just did it. That's weird. Yeah, it is weird. Oh well. And you just did it, but I have to apparently, so... I'm not even going to question them, let's just do it. For it to be successful, I think you have to be the host then. Yep. I have one more person to talk to. There's our scientist friend. Hi, Bryn. How are you holding up? Freelancer. Good. You remember that sixth missing sentinel? The one we couldn't find in the mines? I've discovered a weak signal. Very weak, but it could be him. I'll track him down for you. With earlier losses, we're shorthanded and... Oh. Thank you. The Sentinels appreciate... I mean, I appreciate it. <laughs> I don't like her boss very much. He seems like a dick. The boss is a dick. <laughs> it's like we're doing some good work out there and we're being successful and you're being a dick about it. <laughs> 
Yeah, so I'ma just become the host that we can just get this done quick and then you can be the host that right after. Alright. Uh, I'm guessing I have to go into the oh okay. So is the ranger the only one you've uh, you've used? Uh, no, that, it's not the only one I've used. I used the um. Intercept that, but I mainly used the ranger. Okay, I haven't actually. I don't think I've used the other ones. I think I. I think there was. Maybe another one I used. I don't know. When the game first came out, I played it right off launch, and uh, I was unfortunately hit by. I started playing console this game as soon as I heard about it. Yeah. Yeah. The um, that issue that they had when it first launched, where it was killing consoles. I got hit it's by. It's because that. of the um. The reason why I was killing hostiles is because of the way how they had things set up at that point in time, so they had to change a lot. Yeah, my um, my Project Scorpio, my Xbox X, fucking, it got hit by that. Damn. Yeah. I ended up, uh, ended up being able to reset it to default like three times. The third time I said, fuck it, it's, it's dead, so I traded it in and got an S. <laughs> Shoot, I went to a pawn shop and got mine, I got lucky. Yeah, I just go to EV Games. Are you, uh, are you in the States, I assume? Mm-hmm. You probably got, uh, not EV Games, but I think it's GameStop, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm sure they probably have similar things there where you just like trade in and whatever. Yep. Hello, Powie. I think that's how you say that. Powie. Welcome to the stream. It would be awesome if we had a full squad. Yeah. It's been going pretty smooth. I was though, just, just helping one us. guy out that had a, um, you said what? I was just saying it's been going pretty smooth though. Yeah, it has, but I was just playing with a guy that has an interceptor and I was helping him out increase his story and stuff. Nice, nice. It's going pretty good. We're uh, just doing the campaign stories on each other's. The way the game's set up, it looks like we're going to have to keep trading back and forth, redoing missions, which is fine. That gives me a chance to level up. Mm hmm. And what they don't know, now they know. <laughs> uh, this is Xbox. Is this even on anything besides Xbox? Is it what? Is Anthem even on anything besides Xbox? Yeah, it's on PS4 and on PC. Oh, okay. For some reason, I thought it was an exclusive. Oh, so a good Nah. Nice and simple. Just. Days Gone is an exclusive for PS4. Oh, yeah, I can't wait to play that. I don't have a PS4 yet, but it's on my list. I can't race him. He's not responsible. Yeah, that's on my I'll bucket list, too. I, I always try to get But another uh, game that is on my bucket list is Dying Light. Oh, Dying Light's fantastic. Yeah, I played, I played it for a little bit, and then I got mad because I didn't know how to play it, so I quit. Answer a question. What the hell do you want? I'm still working that out. 
What matters now is you're headed for trouble. How do you know where I'm? The Dominion aren't fooling around. You've gone from a minor nuisance to a serious impediment. They'd like you to stop. Breathing, that is. Once and for all. That's not negotiable. Ah. Ask him. Alex in over his head. It's crazy how Owen's eyes what? like that. Why are you telling us this? Yeah, he got too close to the uh, storm. You mean when you were a complete traitor? No, his eyes didn't get like that. Oh. That's what I figured. I don't think. I don't think his eyes. Get... Nah, it's not because of that. It's probably because he got overwhelming power or something else. It couldn't have been because of the storm. Because if uh -huh. it was because of the storm, our characters, our character eyes would have been like that as well. Yeah, but our characters aren't, um, what are they called, uh, whatever Faye is. Um, Faye, Faye eyes would have been like that. If, but her yeah, but eyes... Faye didn't like, get close. She just, uh, she was on the edge directing us. Okay, another fortress. Any sign of Halleck? Pretty quiet. And, okay, so um... Far. Not loving the idea of being back here. Uh, we always do hard. What's going on? I think we're on hard, right? I see bodies. No Halleck's mm -hmm. face. Dominion. Yeah. Um, was right. Um, I don't even do the missions. I don't even do the river. missions no more if I don't do them on hard. Yeah, I've, I've always done the hardest difficulty possible. This makes more sense. Watch it. They're waiting for you. Mm-hmm. Get better here. Big guy, one and another snake. Yeah, little guys. They got the hauling ass from you with that big ass shit. Yeah, this shield does a, quite a bit of damage and it protects. So. I mean, I definitely feel like a badass. You're supposed to be feeling like a badass. <laughs> yeah, big fucking. Oh man, it's like an Iron Man suit kind of, but. Oh no, nah, mine is more like an Iron Man suit. Yours look like the the um oh, like the big generation. one Iron Man had to get into when he was fighting the Hulk. Yeah, we yeah. already know what's going on, so we can skip this. Oh Over yeah, here. yeah, I suppose we can. Yeah, just get straight to the action. Hey, okay, what is this? Sorry, Owen wasn't kidding. A fury, top of the line Dominion, but you're a top of the line freelancer, right? <laughs> Guys, you know the shit I'm talking about, right? The big suit he jumped in yeah. to fight the Hulk. Yeah, he's like, it's, a, it's his emergency suit. <laughs> and he actually like beats the shit out of the Hulk a little bit. <laughs> he kept hitting him with repeatedly right jabs. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. <laughs> but eventually the Hulk got pissed. Like, the Hulk gets stronger every time he gets pissed, so... Yeah. I mean, what? if you ever want to see something amazing, you should see, uh, uh, you should see the Hulk hey, go against an anime character named Saitama, aka One Punch Man, which is, like, One Punch Man, like, kills everything in one punch, but him and the Hulk, oh, man, they was battling it out. Yeah, I haven't seen too much of the One Punch Man, I, I think I've seen, like, part of an episode, but... Oh, just like you just go to YouTube and type in Taming the Beast, you'll see the video right there with Saitama versus the Hulk. Yeah, but you gotta, you gotta do like, the background. You can't it, just watch like, that one. You gotta watch the One Punch Man, know what it's about. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you mean, but still, like once, once you do watch One Punch Man and so on and so forth, just watch that. Watch, watch it right after. Because when you see the video, I'm gonna just tell you a little bit about the video, not too much, just a little, because it starts off showing Saitama about to go against like a wolf or some sort, next thing you know, 
he um the uh Bruce Banner jumps in front of him and just takes the whole shebang right through a wall and comes out the hook. Like, what the hell? Okay, not gonna last long out here. Then it just Easy goes from there. Hoping it can work a miracle. I'm on it. I'm tied. I'm your finger tails. Saitama even asked the hawk if he was a monster or a villain. Because what Saitama don't know is that the hawk is a hero in the monster of Marvel Universe. Makes sense. Damn it! Every time I go near that thing, I keep hitting the phone. Shield does pretty good for Jack. Nice one. Thank you. How'd you survive? Alright, red dots, red dots. Sir, leave me hanging. Okay, we got a big guy and a float guy, so which one are you gonna go for? Uh, I got the big guy on the right, he's almost dead. Uh, he's dead. Right. Where's the big guy? Alright, the other big guy's down. You can just need a floating guy. Oh, that was how effective the shield is. Oh, another big guy. Taking a few more hits. Hey, you did it. I'm sure they're just getting started. Hey, how's that miracle coming? You just worry about the fight. I'll find a way to get you out of there. Alec, how's it coming? Just focus on the fight. I'll get this suppressive thing sorted. You know, I kind of have to worry about both. No, you don't. That's what I was going to tell you. Trust your team. Do your part. We'll do ours. Everyone wins. When I was trapped in that canyon, I covered the north side. My buddy covered the south. And you know what? I never looked south. This may really be it this time. Use your geography. Find the cover and ambush works both ways. And don't ever retreat. If you do, you're dead. It's going to be forward momentum. One down. That might solve it. Worth a try. I'm on it. Alright. Uh, Alan? I'm trying to disable the generator now. Hang tight. Yeah, sure. I got nowhere else to hang. I that I can't see these guys all the time. Third person view is not very good. So what you saying, you would rather play this game in first person? Uh, no, I mean like, the third person is too close to the player. It should be, uh, should be a little farther away. We have another player. Where is it? Stupid generator! 
kid. Lose your cool and you lose your head. You're not exactly a patient guy, Alec. Off duty, maybe, but in the line of fire, you gotta stay in the moment. Start losing focus and you'll miss the bullet coming straight at you. You got dragon scales too. sequenced. <laughs>
I just got a level 30 gun. Nice. Here's my favorite freelancer. Can't let you go unprepared. Uh, I could take that with me. That'd be more useful. New scenarios. Sounds way better. Uh, yeah, that sounds perfect. <clears throat> Squad is ready. What's the next mission that's going to be done? I gotta go talk to Faye. Okay. Much better. Hello again, Meralda. Hi, freelancer. <laughs> Don't worry, I know who you are. How are you doing? A little better each day. I'm glad to hear it. It was rough going for a bit. You were everything I'd hoped Serana would grow up to be. I'm flattered. It's true. It was hard letting go. Serana sounded like a great kid. You'll always have memories of the good times. Mm, there were plenty of those. You're feeling better? A lot of crying. But mostly a lot of laughing. I looked at paintings I made of her. She was something special. Must feel like a weight has lifted. I won't lie. Looking at you now, part of me still wants you to be Serana when you walk by. Well, for a moment, I think it's her. The illusion's been so real. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to cause trouble. Oh, it's not your fault. It's made me realize I need a change of scenery. Maybe reach out to my sister in Antium. Build a new life. Maybe even start painting again. Sounds like a good idea. Out from her. Oh, I so. oh, shit, that hurt. Oh. And if I don't see you, then. Oh, that Thank hurt. Thank you again. Fuck. And goodbye. Take care. What? I just took my earring out. You took your what? My earring. Oh. Was it stuck or something? Why did it hurt? Uh, Cause like, I got one of those earrings you gotta twist off and I pull. Hey there. Piece of advice. Okay, where do I start? Uh, your temper can get to... No, I'm saying from me to you. Oh. Sure. What have you got? This okay, let me go talk to Faye real quick. Your brain. Someday it'll be the good old days. And we can go move on. And gets freelancers excited. And it reminds Sounds you good. what badass feels like. Years must be catching up if you forgot something like that. Getting an attitude, huh? Looking for signs of senility. I'll have you know the badass courses through these veins. I defined it. The rogue Ursix that terrorized Shadow Gap Trench? I put the final bullet in its brain, or the Battle of Wyvern Horde at Indigo Vale? I was there. Yeah? 
What was it like? A dozen freelancers dropped in from above, down a sheer cliff, landed in a circle on an outcropping. Nothing but death below. No margin for error. Had to surround them. Twelve pairs of boots hit the ground in unison. Twelve guns started blazing. And a bunch of wyvern died wishing they never met a freelancer. It was magnificent. <sighs> no one says those days are over. Been feeling like they are. Sucks getting old. <laughs> Just means you're smarter. Keep rookies like me in check. Oh, maybe. Back in the day, we would have eaten you for dinner. This is nice. Secret spot? Yeah. Takes a little extra to quiet Cypher's mind. You doing okay? Oh, yeah, fantastic. Just questioning the nature of existence. Why I'm here, why you're here. The Shapers, the Anthem, life, friendship, hope. So, just the little things. Would you rather be alone? No, oh, no, I'm glad you're here. You know, when you first showed up at Princess Sims, I wasn't sure this was gonna work out. So then why call Tassin? I was desperate. <laughs> Thanks. Actually, any hesitation was more about Hallett than you. I wasn't sure he'd ever accept you back. She got a pretty smile for a video board. game character. <laughs> it's fantastic. It I've watched him come It's crazy, it's crazy it's nowadays that they use motion capture. Oh, that's just the beginning. We're just getting to the pinnacle of Never what's mind. gonna be great in video games. Me? Oh yeah, I know. Well, <laughs> let's Cause see. now they're making VR. It's my fault that the team's broken up. That our yeah, mission the, failed. The VR is, and Tassin's about to send in probably to their deaths. It's a, and yet it's definitely that, a beginning stepping stone. Uh, it's a rough beginning. No, there's, some, there's something they're working on that that's going to be better because you like you can take the VR headset. That's crazy. Along with like right? a motion, motion, uh, on body movement thing. I don't know what it's called, but friend. like you center yourself on Amazing. it and you no, wear no, like certain type of shoes, and like you're okay, you feeling like it. you're actually in the game. But please don't take off. It's so. Uh, I brought you something. Oh, like I saw a video of oh, it on YouTube. I can't remember what the time. name was, so. What do you think? Can we use that to protect ours? Yes, of course. Why didn't you lead with this? You're my friend. I was listening. You know, like a good person. This is amazing. Yeah, I'll be glad when we get Have full we integration. Tessa? Not the yet. Games. I needed to make sure Owen wasn't, you know, lying. <laughs> Fair point. Well, he's not. I'm gonna let her know we're back in action. Okay. I'll meet you at Halleck's Javelin in the Enclave. Halleck. We'll figure it out. Our people need us to stop the monitor. No one, nothing's more important. Yeah. We're actually gonna do this. <laughs> oh, I did the whole talking to Faye. Did I say anything else? Who's that? I mean, when the game first starts, everybody always talks about how it was always the best one, the best freelancer. But now look at him. Oh, busted up, messed up legs and all. Yeah, he could still do it, I think, if he really tried. Yeah, I give him a mission or two before his legs give away. Uh, 
Okay, now now we can go do whatever mission you got until the daggone thing's done. Uh, did you talk to Halleck after you talked to Faye? Brought you something, Halleck. Yep, I talked to both of them. <sighs> okay, I'm talking to Halleck right now. This is good! <laughs> Owen thinks it's the key to making the Dawn Shield work. Owen? He knew you'd figure it out eventually. Uh, that's nice of him. I guess. <laughs> Two-faced bastard. Hey, listen. <clears throat> I was thinking about what you said. About being a team. My ego. That was probably hard to say to my face. But I needed it. I needed it. Thanks for the kick in the ass, partner. Uh, um, has Faye seen this? Cause I can't figure this out on my own. As luck would have it, here she is. Halleck? Faye? I am so sorry. No, I... Faye. I am sorry. I used to be the best damn freelancer in all of Bastion, but... Not anymore. It pisses me off. I forced you to go behind my back because I didn't want to be a burden. Caring about a friend isn't a burden. It's a gift. <sighs> Let's get to work. Okay. There it is. Thank <sighs> you. Oh, we'll take care of this. Well, they you still go working make sure everything else is ready to head into that storm. Got it. <laughs> okay. So, I'm guessing that last time we came back from my mission, you ended up talking to somebody and then it gave you that mission, right? So, I'm guessing, since we both talked to everybody in full, if we just go do this mission, I think we'll be fine. and We'll both get it. So, I am ready when you are. Okay, um... 299 power. Hmm. Like one away from 300. <laughs> oh. You say what? Um... I was saying I was one point away from 300 power. Uh, don't forget to change the difficulty. Oh, you one power away from 300. <laughs> yeah, 299. <laughs> yeah, I'm, all, I'm almost at 400. Okay, what's the next mission you gotta do? Because I'll let you be the host again. Because we, we both gotta do the same thing anyway. Yeah, I think, um, I think also, as long as... Uh, where's my party? As long as we have all of the chats done with everybody, I think everyone will get the accomplished for the mission. Alright, do you want to do all the side missions or do you want to just do the main? Sure. Alright. We can do whatever. Let's go kick some ass. But remember, strong alone, stronger together. That's definitely, that's definitely for sure. It'd be nice if we did have the other two guys. You know who said that, right? I should because I think I've heard it a few times. Strong alone, stronger together.
that's the freelancer's motto. Yeah, but I think it's I think it was also like said in like some history book or something too by somebody. That's who you're referring Halleck. to. <laughs> Halleck, yeah. Cause when you first play the game, that's what he says. Man, I was so hyped when I first started playing this game. Oh yeah, it's been fantastic to be honest. Good to go, Yara. What's the contract? Give me a location. Hey. Missing freelancer in your area. Hmm. We gotta search for the missing freelancer. We can't actually can know where he is. We gotta find him. Gives us a That's what it looks like. Oh, there we go. It's just delayed because they were talking, I think. Last communication I had from that freelancer was around here. Take a look. I'll see what's here. Okay, we're about to an area. This is this is a life machine. That's why it's packing a letter punch. You are not permitted to enter our circle. Oh, you shit. shall not die. All right, I got this. There's an incomplete contract for us to take. Oh, well, you killed him before I could eat. You got <laughs> Let's go that finish. Alright, where's this question mark at? Yeah. Alright, here. This freelancer has a contract dealing with our force. Let me track down something that will finish this contract. Like, they just a find something similar? <laughs> we can't have that. Okay, I'm on it. Well, apparently we gotta go find the item with the supplies that's been stolen. Supplies must be here. We must go through them. You got it. Who the hell just set me on fire? Probably this, this elemental guy up here. Yeah, there he is. That's good. Alright. Let's see here. Red dot. There you are. Oh, look at drop. Supplies. 
supplies marked and ready for Sentinel recovery. That should be enough. You're done. Done. Okay, more trouble for us. And by us, <laughs> I mean you. Sounds like an animal has gone mad. Not sure. See if you can track it down. I'll get over there. Mad animal. Well, that usually means we have to put something back together. Shit, where are we going? Oh, we're going up. That barrel roll looks so fucking awesome. Huh. Damn, the beast is not here. Search the area. I'll see what I can find. Should be too hard to find a beast. from the remains. Never leaves this clearing. Understood. Alright, Mister doesn't like getting shot in the head. Wait, there's another one of those monsters. <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. He's dead. That was one of the most easiest missions I've ever done. <laughs> yeah. Most of the times the side missions are easier, but occasionally you get one that's real fucking grindy.
bum, 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 bum. Talk about wait time. I'm going to Fort Tarsus from now on. This launch bay is slow. Why is my backup weapon not there anymore? What the hell? <clears throat> oh, my guns disappeared. Figure out my other gun. Why oh, that's not showing up? I mean, most of the time I don't need the gun anyway, but when I do, it'd be nice to have it. <laughs> what did you say the best weapon is that you have? Um, so did that count for you? Did that count for you? Hey! Oh, I forgot what I was 
Epin. Epin. Mm-hmm. Did that mission count for you when we did it? Mm hmm. Alright, do you want to do the final mission? The Heart of Rage? Sure. Alright. Here we go. It works. If you're at Fort Tarsus, you gotta talk to them over by your javelin. You have news. Good news. I am. You ready? Amazing. You did it. Yeah. Where's yours? You'll need a Dawn Shield, too. Halleck's not taking his javelin into the storm with you. No? Nope. The Strider withstood the storm last time. I will make sure she does it again. Hey, what's gonna happen when I hear the anthem? What if I lose myself? You won't. Strong alone, stronger together, right? Ha. Ah, who told you that? Come on, there's no time to waste. The Dominion's already on the march. Perfect. The Monitor probably thinks he's won. He won't even see us coming. Come on, Freelancer. We got a new legend to write. Well, if this is supposed to be the end of the main campaign, I'm excited to see what it is. As far as I can take us before the Strider gets ripped to shreds. Okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. Get ready. If it wasn't this bad before. No, it wasn't. Could be the heart of Razor's growing. Could be the Monitor messing with the Cenotaph. Whoa. Winds are crazy. Watch the rip stream out there. You already met the wildlife. Watch for shadows. That's how you know they're diving at you. Got it. Are you able to put no your back just a little bit from your mouth, please? Just push through as fast as you can. I'm picking up Striders, Tacit Sentinels, I think. Is that they're that? hours away. It's just us in the Dominion now. Good. I think so. It's a freelancer job. Always has been. Ready, Javelin One? Ready Thank you. Are. We've got your back. No problem. You go there and you kick some ass. I don't know why it defaults to easy. Nobody wants to play easy. <laughs> All right, whenever you're ready. This is consumables. <clears throat> Are any of these uh are any of these consumables any good? Are you still there, Bean? Yeah, I'm still here. Okay. Uh, why is it not letting me launch? I tried la launching before, but it didn't let me.
Are you ready? Bean. Bean. Yo. Hey, what's up? That's weird. It's not letting me launch. Yeah. I'm gonna hit the exit and try it again. Not sure why it's not working. It works? It does work. Yeah. Put it on. <laughs> you having it? There, I'm reloading it.
Ready up whenever you end up getting in. Might have to try just starting it and then inviting you. There we go. Did you get the invite?
Oh, 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 oh,
Dominion ahead of you. Yay. We're farther into the heart of rage than any freelancer's ever been. <clears throat> Faye, are you alright? Hala, can you hear me? Is Faye? What's the matter? Lost your cipher? Weak minds just can't handle the anthem, can they? She tried so hard to... Don't worry. You haven't lost your audience. I'll be seeing you soon. Looking forward to it. By the second. I'll touch it. Your little friends are back. I'm getting all misty eyed. I'll give you something to cry about. Is that a relic? The Midian messed with something they couldn't control and it bit them in the ass. Typical. You're gonna have to silence it to get through to the senator. Echoes. You want to eat? Don't worry, Faye. I'm on it. You know the drill. Shut this thing down.
air support. Watch your back! In the eye of the storm. Elwyn was right. The monitor has a machine connected to the cenotaph. Hey, I can communicate with the monitor. His mind is open to me. Learn whatever you can. I've never seen anything like this. And it's blocking my access to the relic inside. The anthem. It's calling me. Come on, Faye. I need you. This is the heart of rage. I need my cipher. Faye? You may have beat me here, but I am silencing the cenotaph.
Wait. He's not here. The monitor's dead.
Cenotaph, its power is out of control. That sounds bad. The storm is growing. Hurry. Bring bada boom. was connected to the monitor. Cypher to Cypher. She knows what to do. How's she doing? I don't know. Not great. I I I'm doing better than you, Halleck. Never mind that. The anthem was interfering. I couldn't reach you. I have to get to that machine. I got you, Faye. No time to lose. I can, I can hear the anthem. What do we do? Dominion seals. To get you to the cenotaph, I need to get closer to the anthem, like the monitor did. Go. While you can. You got this. Oh, well, damn. Hey, let go! Come back! It's V2. 
beautiful. Hey. Okay. I heard it. I heard it and I let it go. Faye, we did it. <sighs> we did it. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh, easy, easy. Oh, oh, oh. So what's next? Nothing. You said one job. No, I didn't. You did. I was there. You were there. <laughs> I mean, maybe I want to renegotiate. But more importantly, who's going to fix my Strider? Our Strider. I think that's what he meant. Doubt it. Well, I'll tell you what. You help me fix it. Now we'll talk. <laughs> well, then I want some upgrades. <laughs> Quite the story. Very well done. Wasn't super spectacular ending, but uh, decent. I'll play some more when my buddy gets updated. Yarrow. So what's the word on the Dominion? Though the Monitor is dead, many still fight on. Talk to you later. Hear me? I hear you. Huh. Bastards are probably here to stay. You came through. Fine work. Of course we did. Never a doubt. Thank you. Time for celebration! Woo! Let's all have a drink. As long as we don't talk about work. What, me? Okay. <laughs> I just need a moment. Can I talk about my Strider? Uh, I have plans. Just give me five minutes to relax with no Strider, no Anthem, no Relics, no Contracts. There's something you need to see. I want you to meet Grandmaster Adams. You entered Freemark. You silenced the Cenotaph. Yes, with help. Right on. Strong alone, stronger together. Hey, let me show you something. We found this just inside the eastern border. Killed two of our team before we were able to put it down. And I mapped the region on it. Urgoth. You've heard of them. From stories, paintings. But they're long gone from Bastion. Oh, this could either be a single scout or the beginning of something much, much bigger. Corvus is worried that the death of the Monitor, while vital, has left us vulnerable in places we never even considered. 
And we're reaching out to you because by all accounts, you're something special. But can you keep quiet about this? We don't want to freak people out. Sure. <laughs> Good. We'll be in touch. Keeping quiet, that's... <clears throat> doesn't usually end well. But uh, I guess we'll see. Okay. So we unlock some strongholds. Challenges. Difficulty, high rewards, all of these what we're after. Alright, I'll finish talking to everybody here so it's all talk to you before we end it. So, you're the one after all. I thought it might be you. The Grand Master talked to you? I talked to him, yeah. What's this about? Oh, you've been making waves. Opening the gates of the Fortress of Dawn? Not bad. But reaching the inner sanctum, all kinds of wheels started turning in Antium when you did that. What do you mean? Why would anybody in Antium care about me? I mean that wheels literally started turning inside the palace. Arden Vasa built some device to tell him if a worthy lancer appeared. I hear it told half the city. That's huge and unexpected. A lot of eyes are watching you now. Wondering what you'll do next. Yes. Well, they're not the only ones. I can help you with that. I guess it's time to properly introduce myself. I'm the law keeper and storyteller for the Legion of Dawn. The Legion is gone. It broke apart centuries ago. And the Lancers left the path, it's true. But there have always been a few souls tasked with keeping the Legion alive. Arden Vasa left the wheels ready to turn for a reason. The path of the Legionnaire has been waiting, like the doors of the Fortress of Dawn, for a worthy Lancer. I passed all the tests. I was welcomed into the Legion of Dawn already. Sort of. The trials proved you're worthy to become a Legionnaire, but you're not one yet. You know the stories of General Tusks. Do you know the tales of her most trusted counsel? I've heard their names, children's stories. But I don't think that's what you're asking. You should know whose footsteps you're following. At the height of the dawn, countless lancers flocked to the banner of General Tarsis. All who had the heart to fight were given a place. But a few were more than just lancers. These were the boon companions of Tarsis, walking the path as she did. The Legionnaires. In the trials, Arden Vasa said something about walking the path, too. You opened the doors, but it's not enough to pass the tests. You must keep walking, day after day. Arden Vasa, builder of the first javelin, the first emperor. Sanadin, whose swiftness inspired Corvus. Medero, Magnastral, and Leotrail the Unbroken. They all had one thing in common. They shared the ideals of Helena Tarsis. And you want me to do that, too? Follow in their footsteps. Become a Legionnaire. So many eyes are watching you. If you can do this, revive the path of the Legionnaire, maybe the glory days of the Legion are only beginning. Well, that's interesting. Grandmaster Adams is here. He's asked you to come see him when you have a moment. Mederon was the son of Arcanists. He had lived his entire life in a cavern, underground, hiding. At ten years old, he had never seen the sky or an Urgoth or any beast but men. The world was utterly unknown to him, except for tales of horror and woe. 
But among the stories warning children to hide and obey their parents, Medeiron heard one other, a whispered tale of a rebellion against the Urgoth and a legion rising to set all people free. So, at just ten years old, Medeiron left the safety of the Arcanists to find the Legion of Dawn. His parents couldn't have just let him go, could they? They forbade him, of course. But he picked his moment and ran away. Raised to be a scholar, he knew how to read the secret signs of the Arcanists. He followed them through the wilds to the Legion of Dawn. Or he tried to, anyway. The Chimera had a different plan. Is this the kind of story where a small boy fights a chimera with a stick and a rock? No. Although most of those stories you've heard are based on Medeiron. He'd never seen a chimera. He'd never even seen a grabbit. But he was a very good student. He learned all the warning signs that he was being hunted, and remembered stories about laying false trails. He led the chimera on a long and winding path through the rocks, back and forth. He could never shake the creature, but it could never find him. Then. The other hunters came. General Tarsis, in the first javelin ever made. Testing her new armor, she found the Chimera stalking the boy. Lucky for Medeiron. No luck about it. Tarsis followed his trail, just as the Chimera did. She was just learning the javelin. No one knew what it could do, not even the man who made it. Not trusting her suit's strength in a fight with the Chimera, she lured it into chasing her instead. While it ran after Tarsis, Leotrell found the boy and spirited him away to safety. After all that, he just went home again? It's not much of a story. I said safety, not home. They took him to their own camp, where the Legion hid at the time. When Tarsis asked where he lived and who his people were, Medeiron replied, You are my people. The others tried to persuade him to return home, but after a long moment, Tarsis said, he is home. From then on, Medeiron served as a page to the Legion of Dawn. Eventually, he became a legionnaire himself. But that's another story. Intriguing. Okay. Challenge of Valor. So events, strongholds, contracts, quick play. So we actually have to do some quick play next time we're on. Madam Chronicler. Ah, you did it. Did what? Silence the heart of rage, my dear. Who'd have thought? Well, I had help. Halleck and Faye. Who are you serving with modesty? You did a great thing and you must acknowledge it. As my mentor, Nagandel, used to say, you know who Nagandel is, of course. I must admit, I don't. How is that possible? He's only the greatest cipher who ever lived, and royalty. Oh, my dear. Is it possible you have amnesia? I don't have amnesia. We've been through this already. We have? <gasps> How ironic that I should forget that. <laughs> <gasps> As Neg Andel used to say, and say to me in particular, let others celebrate your gifts for what is ordinary to you is a miracle to another. I guess so. Things will never be what they were, but they are getting better. And so I shall reward you with the gift of knowledge, of course. Of course. I'd like to present you with an old favorite of mine, the Freelancer Three. It's about as famous as you will be. <laughs> Thanks very much for the book, Madam Chronicler. And now I should get going. See ya. See ya. Yeah. You can't muster a better goodbye than that. Ah! I believe I can. May bright skies overhead shine light upon your paths, madam. Mm. Bit overboard, perhaps. <laughs> I'll keep working on it. Goodbye, freelancer. Goodbye. All right. 
Looks like everything's in this direction. That's wonderful. I'm so happy for you. And one of them is downstairs. Possibly. No. Let's walk around the boat. Huh? Oh, look, there's one. Hey, remember Karila and the package and how she killed that guy and you told me to go to the Sentinels? Once the killing started, it just made sense to get the authorities involved. Oh, you made a good call. When we got back to my place, there was nothing there. No Karila, no package, and when I checked her place, spotless. What did the Sentinel say? Their commander, Vool, said I was lucky they didn't arrest me for wasting their time. I was confused, relieved, and embarrassed all at the same time. And the weirdest thing of all, after the Sentinels left, Karila shows up. Seriously? I know. She says, thank you, Amal. Then gives me the sweetest kiss of my entire life. I just hope she got her share of the ember. The package was filled with ember? It's crazy what people will do for ember, huh? But now she's gone. Her place is empty and I have no idea where she is. She's a dangerous person. Maybe it's best she's out of your life. Yeah, I guess she did kill that guy. But he was gonna kill me. But she did try to give me the package. She was a lot of trouble. I'm sure gonna miss her. <laughs> yeah. That was the interesting story. Oh, you got nothing to say, Mr. Stories? No, nothing. Leighton. Good to see you, freelancer. That name, the one that's been bothering you. Aurora. I mentioned it to your wife. You did? You can't keep going like this. It's killing you. Maybe, but remembering the wrong thing could be just as bad. You're used to taking risks, aren't you? Calculated ones. Then what are your odds if you do nothing and these memories eat you alive? I... I would lose Nadira. I suppose it's a gamble I have to take. What did you find out? Who was this Aurora? Nadira thought she was connected to a Dominion operation. Does Prism Tacit mean anything to you? This... This was... Leighton? This was a mistake. We shouldn't have done it. What? I'm remembering now. You have no idea what's going on here. Whatever it is, we need the truth. It's the only way this gets solved. You may regret that. Then tell me why. A Dominion plan to infiltrate Corvus. A cipher mentally programmed to pose as a defector. Uh, wait a minute. Underneath the defector's persona, the real agent remembers everything he sees and hears. Oh, crap. I remember who I am. You're the agent. My name is the Trigger. I'm Prism Tacit. Maybe so, but your persona... I don't think it was a lie. His regret, your regret, sounded genuine. It was deemed the most probable way to gain her trust. Who? Aurora, the code name for the enemy operative likely to have useful intelligence. My wife, Nadira. You used her? It's why her name is so painful to hear. I think I was wrong about you. No, I was wrong about myself. The man I was programmed to be has become the man I want to be. My conscience began as a facade, a layer, but it fed the seeds of doubt, of truth. I understand the pain I've caused, that I will cause. I really do love her. But I pulled away, knowing what the other part of me planned. I can't lose her. Maybe in the world of spies, this is how things go. Maybe she'll understand. Spy or not, she's still my wife. She saw the best in me. And I returned the favor by giving her my worst. And now? Tell my wife. It's your obligation to Fort Tarsis. I'm done lying. She was right, you know. I needed to make a friend. You've helped me understand myself. But don't risk yourself or others. Repeat the trigger now. My persona will forget we had this conversation. If you insist. Prism Tacit. Freelancer, I'm sorry I must have drifted again. These damn memories. W what were we saying? Nothing. I was just leaving. Well, shit. Guess we better go have a chat with her.
Conversations down here, by the looks of it. Uh, all right, we'll find her at some point. Let's just go around the room. What was your favorite name the bars had? Fine. The Golden Grabbit. Remember? Are you Sev? In the flesh. You must be the freelancer Tassin hired. Huh. You actually look capable. Uh, that's weird. Talk to this guy. Were you expecting otherwise? No. Well, sort of. I'm used to getting scraps, not resources. I thought Corvus would have plenty to go around. Oh, they do. But I'm in the proverbial doghouse. Long story short, I pissed off the wrong people and ended up in this shithole. At first glance, Fort Tarsus may not seem like much, but... It's a shithole. The bar doesn't even have a name. It used to, but... I know the story. All the stories, let's just talk about the job. Corvus has been tracking an Ascari that calls itself Skelos. Any Ascari? Powerful Scar with superior intelligence. They can command entire swarms to do their bidding. If it's intelligent, maybe this Skelos can be reasoned with. Ah, uh, no. It'll still kill you on sight. I sent a team of agents to ambush Skelos. It, it didn't go as planned. The creature was able to retreat to its nest before we could finish the job. Where's the swarm located? In a cave network underground. I, I won't lie to you, Freelancer. This is... gonna be tough. Send the coordinates to Faye. We'll contact you when I reach the nest. Well, that was interesting. Oh, another conversation. Hey, hey, my friend. Alec? Feeling okay? Yep. Had a bottle of cackleberry wine. Been waiting years to pop it open. <laughs> Needed the right occasion. Ah. Mm. Faye calls it truth juice. So I'm waiting here for the truth of life to infuse my brain. Hoping the anthem might sing to me. Anyway, so. I once took a whiz in my javelin. Halleck, I think it's a different kind of truth juice. Hey, if you gotta go, you gotta go. Made my bladder gladder right there in the suit. Sure. Who hasn't tested the hydraulics out once in a while? <laughs> hydraulics. See? Truth is, I never thought you were funny. At all. Like, ever. Never? Nope. But, the truth of your truth is I like you anyway. You're a good friend. Just don't go telling Halleck I said that. <laughs> Feelings mutual. You're not such a bad guy after all. What? You've been drinking cackleberry wine or something? Nope. This is me 100% sober. Huh. We need to change that. Hey, reminds me. I once took a whiz in my javelin. So I've heard. Yeah, but have you heard I'm the Crimson Lancer? Pretty sure they based the whole show on me. Seize your glory, Lancers. Into the maw. Death is just a reunion with old friends. It's uncanny. Right? Don't need wine to see that. <laughs> Damn it. What's wrong? This? Listen. Perhaps you could reconsider the teaching position. I just want you to be safe, Ducky. I... My father died in a storm. Mother thinks I'll end up the same. She hates what I do. I dread her messages. They're always the same. Tears, pleading. She might need more time to get used to your job. It's been three years and about 30 messages. Or maybe not. I've talked to her about my work, tried to get her interested. No luck. Would teaching really be so bad? I'm not sure. I'd be decent at it. People say I'm good at explaining things. And 
Shaping young minds does have its appeal. But how could I leave all this? We talked about this. Loving the work, the thrill of discovery. The danger is only part of it. I'm afraid I'll regret leaving. Or oh, miss out on some great discovery. Stay strong. Don't apologize for what you want. Do what makes you happy. Does that make me a bad person? Not really. You can't control how she feels. And you can't live your life for her. Oh, the guilt. You'll be okay. Drink some tea. Oh, I'll go through several pots tonight. <laughs> Trying to formulate a response to my mother. Thanks for listening, though. I appreciate it. Anytime. Alright. So we need to find a wife at some point. I don't want to know. Always test the load before lifting. Hello. Hi, Brundle. Fair warning. I am in a dark and foul mood. Any way I can cheer you up? There's a chance. You could help me with some perspective. I'll try. What's going on? My foot traffic initiatives were defeated. I've made zero progress on the loose cables hazard. And my proposed standing water bylaw is now dead. That sounds tough. So what's your plan? My plan is to leave the fort. Ask me, I think you should stay. That's kind of you to say, but my future lies in Antium. Why would you move to the capital? Because it's filled with bureaucrats and politicians who like making rules and consider personal safety a priority. Those are my kind of people. They are, huh? It's terrible to admit, but I feel I've wasted my life trying to make this fort a better place to live. I think you've made this fort better. Why do you say that? Because you've always been more than just a safety guy. That's true. I've always loved maintenance. Yeah, you've made a real difference there, right? Well, we've cleaned up the market. We're improving facades, and our horticulturalist has done some lovely planting. You've just made me realize I have made our fort a better place to live. You sure have. And I have unfinished business here. What's that? The fountain in the courtyard still isn't functioning. You sound determined. I am. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got a fountain to fix. Well, it's about time. I'd like to see the fountain running. Ba -ba 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 -ba. All right. How's it going? I'm reading and writing. And? There is no and. Must there be something else? I guess there doesn't need to be, if you're happy the way you are. I am content. Yes, Maddie requires novelty. Sumner needs something to be angry at. I find that my academic pursuits fulfill my needs. Someone must be the archivist. Don't the others? They help. Their diverse perspectives are critical. But of late, most of the scholarly tasks have fallen to me. You're probably the best suited to it, of the three of you. Precisely my thought. Where I go from here is simple. I am the Arcanist. Among the three of us, I've had the easiest time adjusting to the Division. Matthias was an Arcanist. I am still an Arcanist. The non-scholar parts of Matthias must figure out their place. It can't be easy. I'm glad you're our friend. That means you'll be here for them. Wouldn't have it any other way. I'm glad to hear it. Now I should let you go. See you around, Errol. Freelancer. How are things? You know, trying to keep busy. Maddie's out finding new fun things to do. Errol's working on work, and I'm trying to find where I fit in, I suppose. 
It's messy. I feel set adrift sometimes. You'll make it work. That's what you do. You figure out how to make the best of a situation. It's easier when I have a target. Someone to be angry at or something to work on. What would you do? I'd go with my gut. It's never led me astray. You sound like Maddie. Maddie can be right sometimes. Yes, I know. My gut tells me I should talk to him about this. I think that's a wonderful idea. Just watch. He'll tell me I should go searching for myself in a scar hive or something. And if you run into trouble, I'll be there. Anyway, I won't keep you. See you around. Interesting. Freelancer, it's always a treat to see you. So you went into the heart of rage and survived. That's twice now, isn't it? Do you think I could ever do that? Observe the center of a cataclysm? Actually see something like the cenotaph? With enough training, a really powerful suit, and an armed escort, you could maybe survive in a cataclysm for 10, 20 seconds. A worthy goal to aim for. You know, the last person I knew who wanted to be a lancer ended up betraying me. Owen. Oh, right. I didn't mean... I don't really want to be a lancer. I just want to see more of the world. Sometimes a javelin is the only way. I want to explore. I want to do things. Make my mark somehow. Haven't you already done that? I couldn't have silenced the cenotaph without you. But that... That was all of us. Oh, I see. This is about being separate. I know. Selfish, isn't it? It's not selfish, it's natural. Denying you felt that way would be worse. I knew it. I knew you'd understand. We could be arcanists and more. The breadth of experience we could bring to our research could only help. Ugh. Chatting with you is always rewarding. Isn't that what friends are for? Absolutely. No, oh, that's gone well. Okay. Well, that's, uh... Seems like everybody in the area. Let's go back down. We thought he died at a memorial. He's still alive. That's a good thing, even if he joined the Regulators. We thought that maybe, maybe he did it to survive. I don't know. I haven't been able to get a message to him. And haven't they moved on now? Yes, I've heard they're at Third Hope. Even if that's true, they'd shoot me before I even got close. I'm sorry. I wish I had a solution for you. There's always a solution. Just gotta be willing to look for it. There you are. You miss Palatinaro's duet. I may have recorded it. Good, good. There you are. I have news on our missing Shaper fragments. You found them? Not exactly, but I do know that that coward Diggs is planning on selling them off to the highest bidder. An auction? Yes. Some of the Arcanists you rescued overheard a few things. Gave me the idea. Where would this happen? I talked with some freelancers. Got some locations that would be ideal. Uh, my gut tells me Diggs won't wait long to do this. Sounds right. Okay, I'll get out there and start a search. Alright, we're still gonna find the wife. The heart of rage is no more. Freelancers kept their promise. I will shout this from the rooftops. The rooftops, you hear me? I hear you. Okay. I do like the automatic doors opening. Ok. 
Okay, we go down to the bar. We know she's not down there. There's a lot more people around. So sweep around here. Need to double our recruiting efforts with the recent trouble. Strange that I can't find Those her. Are part of rage and forcing back the Dominion. Nice day's work, freelancer. The only place left is the front entryway. I guess she could be out there. Hi, Johnny. There you are. Heard you got back in one piece. Were you worried? No. Yes. I mean, the Heart of Rage and I have a nasty history. Right. I heard you were in Freemark. You're a great freelancer. But that storm killed some of our best. We can't forget those who died, but at least no one else will die there. Thank you. It means a lot to me and my brother. You're welcome. Anyway, congratulations. You're a big fish now. You should celebrate. Look around this place. The difference you've made is amazing. Thanks. I especially love that they fixed the Lancer statues in the courtyard. They meant so much to me as a kid. How come? Well, Fort Tarsus was my home and my prison, safe behind the walls, day in, day out. But Lancers? Lancers got to see the whole wide world. They were hope. When I felt cold or small, I'd sit across from the statues and my daydreams would warm me up. So, yeah, the fort is feeling better. More like home. Things will only get better from here. Hope so. Will I see you around then? I'll be around. Take care, big fish. Big fish, huh? There she is, hero of Fort Tarsus, the heart of rage, no less. I knew you'd bring the thunder. And some lightning along with it, you know, to make a statement. You've been listening. Damn, that makes me proud. You might have rubbed off. To think, when we first met, the forge wouldn't even work. And now, you tamed the mother of all storms. The freelancers are back. And not even the Anthem's temper can stop them. Thanks. I'm sure some new trouble is bound to come along. In this world, I guarantee it. Not a month goes by, I'm not shaking my head at some crazy thing a Shaper Relic has done. But I'll feel better knowing the freelancers are back in business. We wouldn't be anywhere without the guy selling us a little thunder and lightning. No, I just bottle it. You deliver it. Well, don't ever stop. We'll need plenty of bottles, I'm sure. What I wanted to hear. <laughs> I'd best get back to it. Don't be a stranger. I shall not be a stranger. We should get lots of work done.
Although I still can't find the wife. I don't know where she went. You should have tried to jump the gap instead of going around. There's dominion along the route. If you jump the chasm, you can avoid them. What sort of... You can't jump a strider. Well, everyone inside has to brace real hard, but it can be done. I'd only do it with a ride that's been recently serviced, though. If the struts fail, BAM, you're in trouble. You're kidding. Nah, I do it all the time. <laughs> well, she's rough on her equipment, clearly. Okay, what the hell? Why can they get out there and I can't? Fine when the place was empty, but now there's people out there and I can't get to them. You know, you surprised me. How's that? I never questioned your battle skills, but your resolve and mental toughness exceeded my expectations. Thank you, Tessa. Do you know what I like about you? My eyes. What? Hmm? Uh, no, don't be. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you something important. Sorry, I thought we were connecting. I admire your loyalty. You stuck by your friends and stayed true to Fort Tarsus. That's just the kind of freelancer I am. I agree. Did you know that besides resourcefulness, courage, and intelligence, Corvus values loyalty above all? I do too. We may have more in common than you think. Are you saying I'd make a good spy? Agent. Right. Agent. No. Working for Corvus is a gift. We are the eyes and ears of Bastion. But it comes with risks. Like dying alone. Being abandoned by your own government. And in certain times, even reviled as a traitor. You make it sound so fun. You joke, but freelancer life can also be unforgiving. I guess we both have lousy jobs, huh? Yes. But it's a living. Did you just crack a joke? No. I work for Corvus. We never joke. That's what I thought. I'll be in touch. I'm sure you will. Interesting. Oh, so nowhere left to look. I'm guessing I have to leave and come back at some point. So, I suppose that shall be the end for now. And we'll come back and do some more of the side stories. And then... And grind out some gear. So, if you like this video, hit the like. If you dislike the video, smash the dislike. And if you'd like to subscribe to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. But please also follow me on Mixer and Twitch as well. And if you'd like to know when I'm uploading or streaming, which I am usually streaming, make sure you hit that little notification bell and you will be notified. Alright, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And peace out until next time.